Petro underscore Serbian underscore Knight underscore official. Yeah. Sam Gas. Falls. <laughs> <laughs> What's up guys, we're back with another video. Go get your merch, link in the description as always. E60 2011, gotta edit that up, edit it up already. <laughs> Look at this guys, E60 2010, 535XI. This is a N54 motor. So we got the windshield tint, every window tinted dude. What percent is the uh, windshield? 15. So limo tin on the rest and 15 on the windshield. Can you even see at night? Nope. Check this out guys, this thing has some aftermarket wheels. <laughs> Debadged. Real clean, you know it's raining outside. We got the Daytona. Daytona and the Beam. So what kind of options does this thing have? It has a uh, full head sport package. Uh, uh, it's got the headlamp, it's got the heads up display. Uh, uh, sick. Power steering. Power steering, sick option. Um, uh, power steering. Uh, uh, power that steering, that? yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, we got that power steering option, boy. Power seat. Shoot. Power seat. Power seats. Steering wheel seat. Uh, uh, power adjusting steering wheel, power adjusting seats. I mean, that's typical stuff, bro. What's an option that a typical 5 Series wouldn't have? That's four package options. That's it? What do you mean? I mean, there's got to be something else. The heads-up display is not standard. Seats also, they adjust like five, it's like ten different options. Uh, uh, <clears throat> Get the <laughs> sorry, man. Uh, uh, <laughs> SMG or whatever. SMG Trans. We got a stick shift right here. This is a 12-speed diesel V12. <laughs> Crank windows. Yep. This thing comes out. You know, typical Beamer stuff. Then you throw it, throw it back. <laughs> GPS. Yeah. Yeah, it came with a hat and a jacket too. Straight out yeah. the factory. You know, crank windows, whatnot. Oh, you have a sunroof, that's optional. That's not standard. This is that American Airlines option. You know, you got the good, good cup holders. I heard that if you gun it, they'll never fall out out of those no. cup holders, no. No, yeah, it doesn't have enough power. Yep, yep. <laughs> you got your fake M badge. Yep, yep. It's, it's not fake. It's not fake, it's a real M badge, M -badge. but it's not an M. So that makes it a fake M badge. Yeah. There you go. All right, let's pop the hood, bet. Pop the hood. Bet, this guy's already, he knows what's up. He knows what's going on. He knows what's going on. Serbian Knight official. Wait, what's their Instagram? Wait, what's their Instagram? Tell me your Instagram. DJ Petro. You can find me on Instagram at Serbian Knight official, DJ Petro. Isn't there like a bunch of underscores? Yeah, underscore. Yeah, underscore. <laughs> Yeah, we underscore. V10 right here. V10 underscore. Yep. 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 All dusty. But it's diesel. But it's diesel. Exactly. But it's diesel. But no, seriously, this is a 3.0 inline six with a single turbo that's a twin scroll. A lot of people say that they're twin turbo, this and that. That's not true. It's not true. It's a single turbo, single turbo, but it's got twin scrolls, twin scrolls. So this thing puts out stock like 300 horse. So it's like a V6 charger. I mean, it's pretty slow. <laughs> If you mod this thing at all, just tune, just tune, nothing else. This thing will be quick, quick. Not like a 335, this thing's obviously heavier being a five series, but nonetheless, quick car, good motor. Have you had any issues with it? No, not really. No, not really. Yeah. Yep, he's a liar too. All right, yep. Those are LED angel eyes, right? And then you got the xenon headlights. Xenon headlights. Fog lights are LED, I assume. So it's all white. 
pure white when you uh, hit the lights. But yeah, I'm liking these wheels, dude. These wheels are really nice, actually. Way better than the stockies. Let's see the trunk space. I already know you got a body Don't in the trunk. Don't even open it. He's got a body in the trunk. It's all good, though. <laughs> Hey guys, we got heated seats, traction control, trunk open, heated passenger, you know, your standard climate control, CD action. I don't know anyone who uses CD action anymore. You got a cup holder here. You got a cup holder here for your passenger. And you got the sunroof. Oh, I'll edit that out. I don't know what the <laughs> f that was. <laughs> oh my God. Okay. How long have you had this car? Three years. Wow. Unreal. Oh my god! So, do I sell it? No, I'm not gonna sell it. Will I upgrade? Yeah. But I won't sell it. Huh. Giving you trouble? No. None bad? No. Nothing bad. Uh, From a Beamer? Surprising. All right, when he sells this thing, somebody come by because it's the only Beamer that I've ever heard of that has never had trouble. I had a check engine light for almost a year and still nothing. <laughs> hey, I guess check engine light, but that doesn't mean anything, you know? Keep My yeah, dude. No, yeah. <laughs> My yeah, dude. Name three positives, three negatives about him. Outdated a little bit. Uh, um, I still didn't do the tune on it, and I'm scared to do the tune on it. So a negative is it's stock. You think yeah. that's a negative? Yeah. What about three positives? Comfort, I already know. Comfort, yeah. Probably, yeah. Okay. Probably, yeah. Okay. It's pretty quick. I, I'm not gonna say it could be like no. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even but keeps up a good fight. What about all-wheel drive? You think that's a positive or a negative? <laughs> negative. Really? A negative all-wheel drive? A lot of people would I argue love, against that. I love rear-wheel drive. Me too. <laughs> what else? What else would be a positive? I mean, you probably like the look. It's outdated, but it's still like, like it's, it's BMW. Like I would it. say that this thing is not really outdated because this is, uh, you know, this is a classic BMW look. You cannot beat the E90, E92, E60. I think those are the most iconic ones. The E46 is the, is the top iconic BMW though, for sure. But yeah. you had, right? Yeah. You used to have a three series. How wide are these tires? Dude, this thing is so thin, I can't no, even over, read. Over oh, here we go, here we go. 245, 35, 19s. These tires are kind of small for the wheel, right? Because the tires look stretched. Yeah, the tin is pretty crazy. I like this a lot. Wheels, don't call them rims. A lot, a lot. The wheels. Yeah, but for just doing that, I mean, this car looks really nice, dude. Dude, lower it? What do you think yeah, about that? Lord, That's too flex. That's too, too flex. It's, it's too, too flex. It's too, much. it's too flex. DJ Petro, we call him that. DJ Petro, dude, Serbia Night official underscore on Instagram. Instagram straight flex. <laughs> Pop Miley on. It ain't no Daytona! Here we got GPS, telephone, contacts, vehicle info, onboard information, all the good stuff, all my warnings, plenty of that. No, not really. <laughs> yeah. No problems in this car at no all problems. whatsoever. Honestly, the front windshield is not even that dark. It's not. From the inside. This man is going the complete opposite way he's supposed to in this parking garage and gunning it. What's your driving impressions of this thing? I like it. It's, you know, it's agile. It grips really well. Like the all-wheel drive like, system. Yeah, it's it's probably one of the best. You think it's better than Subaru? Because a lot of people say Subaru is the best. Yeah, but I'm not I'm not comparing the Subaru to BMW because BMWs, BMWs are BMWs. Um. <clears throat> <laughs> So yeah guys, this is a V12 Aston Martin uh, Vantage. It's pretty flex, but it's slower than my Daytona, so it doesn't even matter. 
All right, guys. But yeah, that's it. I mean, we got driving impressions. We got we covered some mods. We covered we covered some mods. We covered uh, ownership review. We covered what he thinks are positives, negatives. We covered his Instagram, which you can follow in the description below. It's Serbian night official, but it's got like 500 underscores, so I got to figure that out. <laughs> that's the 2010 e60 n54 535 xi and this is an ownership review slash car review slash a little messing around you know it's not really aston martin for those of you guys who might have thought that this was an aston martin is not you got the daytona in the back that's right daytona boy i mean i mean you should get a 535 if you're considering it so Check out my other videos. I got videos on my Daytona. I'm gonna be trying to figure out what else to do with my Daytona for videos. So let me know what you guys want to see. We got this video now. We got videos at, at dealerships. We got everything. So go check it out. I'm out. Have fun. And uh, yeah, see you guys next time. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. He wanted to tell you guys something. Sam Gas, baby.